All right, we're playing some AD on NA. If you're just tuning in, with uh, with viewers, with with four viewers, so be nice. Okay, be nice. I've got wrong runes as well. I uh, got misfortune runes instead of Ezra runes. But apart from that, we're we're, we're fine. We're Gucci. I think pressy attack would be okay during the laning phase. I don't. Th it might not be that bad. I don't know. We'll see. Would miss the healing that the Conqueror would give, but ironically we've got Ravenous Hunter, so it's gonna make up for that a little bit. I don't know. It's a bit scuffed, but luckily we've got presence of mind, otherwise this would be a lot worse. Uh, we're up against a Shaco and a Sivir Botlin. So we just chill. We might get pushed in a little bit. It's not a very good combination actually, the Sivir plus the Shaco, because it's like um Like, Sivir's gonna push in the lane, but Shaco wants, like, boxes in the lane. I mean, and, like, he wants us to come out. So, I don't know. It's a bit weird. I always know a shortcut. Well, we'll see how it does. I'm not a fan of when Yumi doesn't buy health potions, by the way. I, like, I actually, like, hate Yumi's that do that. <laughs> it's good to know that one of my long-time subs... Raffio, who's been supporting me for a long time, is uh, is one of those Yumi's. Mm -hmm. Just think it's really greedy because I think like on Yumi you should be looking to auto attack more in the lane. It means that you, you're very very vulnerable and you won't be able, you'll be basically attached the, most of the time. It's like super 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 greed. Ow, that's a good blade actually. It's obviously going to be boxes in the brush. Nice. It's the attack, Pog. Those Sivir Boomerang Blades though. Very nice. Oh! That exhaust could have been sooner, but that's fine. That's a pretty nice guess of the Q. Oh no! Nice. Yeah, if I land that Q with the W attached, the Essence Flux, then it, I wouldn't have had the flash, actually. I don't think so, at least anyway. Yeah, I wouldn't have had the flash. So Essence Reaver is first item, right? Uh, we get the Sheen, we get the Boots and a Refillable. That is fine. We can pick up a control ward as well. I'm feeling generous. Nice. Not bad start. How's everyone else doing in the game? Garen versus Darius. Proper lore. I think Darius wins that though, right? Lux versus Galio. I think that's a nice lane for Lux early at least anyway until she gets mana regen in order to be able to like push back the wave. I think Galio kind of has the slight advantage there. Oh man, I'm missing CS. Trying to thin out this wave a little bit. It's the first time I've seen Shaker do uh, a shiv there, actually.
Right, now we've got this lane out a little bit. We can look to being a bit more aggressive. I can probably put control actually in that. Okay. <laughs> we like to put control into the uh, that brush there actually in a second, I think. Missing a lot of CS. Ugh. Sometimes on AD carry games, it just feels like it's quite hard to CS on the ping. But it's going to be a trap in that brush. Just kind of just need to stay away from the brushes. Isn't cool down on that. Yeah, I felt that. Bit of a freebie there. Shaco is. Okay, well I'm dead. Why the hell is Galio ulting there like that? <laughs> Wasn't expecting Evelyn. Yeah, it sucks that they're all really, really, really there. I'd use a lot for that actually. It's a shame we lost Yumi like that earlier. Crap. Hmm. Rip. So yeah, evidence gonna be a big problem in this game. Can you clear this up properly? Okay. It's a bit nervous there because I thought those many minions were gonna go into turret, which they are kinda gonna go into turret. Shaco, uh, Clan getting a weed into our face then. It's nice wave me pushing in this one. Can you help push? There's one thing a lot of supports need to like learn and understand like we need to get back. Timed that Q badly. Thank you. 
We shouldn't acute that, and then I would have ulti here. This needs pushing still. Is it worth it for a plate here? This might be a little greedy. Okay. Is that chroma on Yumi? Yeah, it is. Base one on that is black and no, it's not even black and white, is it? I legit can't remember. It's not that. <laughs> it's not. It's definitely not that bright. Black and white, I think, was the token chroma. Actually, I don't know what the. Base model actually even looks like. So it's going okay on the map right now. Everywhere's generally pretty even. The, the main scary one is Evelyn. Evelyn is uh, going to be pretty scary. Everyone needs to buy controllers for her. Yeah, she walked into it. Nice. I actually need to read exactly what Essence Reaver does. I don't think I've picked it up since they changed it. Using ability, your next attack is enhanced. Uh, physical damage restores 40% of the damage. Okay. That's mana. Okay. I don't really need to recall. I think we can stomp them. It's just like Evelyn is the problem, actually. We might need to respect that. Like, we beat them easy 2v2. Two two. It's just... Alright, Evelyn's mid. Evelyn's dead. Evelyn could be coming down soon because of the respawn. No, no, no. It's time to go. Alright, so Duska, I believe, is next. What kind of boots do we get? It's a CDR boots. Yeah, CDR boots into Duska. Trinket. Okay. So far, so good. That one death was a bit oof, but apart from that, we're doing alright. Uh, moonstone on Yumi. Stuff of Flame Water soon. Mids holding on, which is fine. Top is doing alright. Ahead, actually. Olaf's doing fine too. He hasn't died yet. We could look at doing Drake. I'm a bit worried about Evelyn though. Like I feel like Evelyn is gonna look for bot. 
especially with the Drake up. Could walk into that Shaco trap, by the way, actually. Mm -hmm. That's a clone, yeah. I think we can fight this still, there, guys. Just need vision. Just... Yeah, that's pretty scuff. Evident flashed away. Okay, Shaco went base, I think, then. That arcane comet was really far away. I'd say you can kind of tell where he is. Just trying to get as many mystic shots off as possible on this minion wave just to get my ulti back in a bit quicker. Up top. Alright, let's go for the Drake. I mean, Evelyn's here. Evelyn's. Oh no, she's not. She's actually top. Alright, never mind. She's good. Evelyn's gonna be around. I'm not really free to stay here properly like that. Do you know why Yumi sometimes procs Moonstone for no reason? Um, no. I had a situation where I W'd someone in my fountain and there's no way that they, that champion could have been in combat and I was put into combat for some reason. I, I don't understand sometimes how that works. But, you know, Riot's coding is pretty spaghetti sometimes, so... I mean, what is that Sivir doing? They're looking for something here, aren't they? She's nearly killed her. Yeah, I know we need to go back and stuff, but they messed up a big push like that. I think we can exploit that for now. Hit it. So if not hit Evelyn now.
fine. We can go back. That's pretty good, though. Karen got tier 2 during that as well. Uh, it's tier man next now, isn't it? QSS could be quite nice, actually, against the Evelyn. Let's do that. I don't need to be too greedy, I don't think. I sold that for a controller. Two controllers, actually. There we go. Good. So the main problem is just Evelyn. Apart from that, we're fine. I think our team's doing generally pretty well, actually. So... You can even start thinking about Baron soon. I've never built Duskar on Ezra before, so this is going to be a... Uh, an experience. Seven hundred damage and press the attack. Yeah, it's actually not been that bad. But I think we're gonna get many press the attack procs off though from now on. Mainly it's gonna be Q poke now, I think, but we'll see. Evelyn's bot. I'm actually just gonna ult her. What am I doing? I'm trolling. I'm actually trolling. I'm mega well. I forgot I was stealth actually after that kill. I didn't need to panic so hard. Why did I arcane shift into a Darius though? What is wrong with me? Classic Ez syndrome there. I think I thought my E was my W or something there. I don't know. No. Rip you. Man. Ah. Yeah, I'm surprised you mean attached there actually. But it's okay. Try to go back to try and get safe. <laughs> um, yeah, boof. Yeah, they're in the shift over the wall. It would have been really nice kiting as well, actually. I think we could have probably killed the wall, actually. Yeah. Because it was a really nice position there. Three around here. The Siva was actually... I wasn't expecting seeing Siva here, but we would have been able to kill her really quickly. The Siva would have died really quickly. We would have gotten invisible. And then it would be, like, just popping off from there, I think. But it is not to be, it's just okay, it's okay. Go on a sec. Oof, nearly. Space tank everything, isn't it? It's just me. We are allowed to do that. Zoom, zoom, zoom. Do you have a control word for like that? Tokyo got gifted a tier one sub to Herdy Gurdy. Hey Tokyo, thank you for giving us up. That's very kind of you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I kind of want to play around with these guys a bit more though. <laughs> it's too fun.
that's good practice. Oof. Yay, I finally caught you live and you are playing ADC even. Good luck with your games, why, why? Tokyo got gifted a tier 1 sub to Lucky Fat Finger. They have given ah, three flash. gift subs in the channel. Hey Jin, thank you. And Tokyo, thank you for giving another sub. That's super kind of you. Thank you guys. How's Garen doing on top? I might go bot side here actually. Garen's not pushing in top as hard as I want it to be. Get tier 2 here. Got Ocean Soul in one minute 30, we might as well just reset now. Cool. Mm, really should pick up more controls, but honestly, I'm <laughs> I think we just pick up the Warhammer. Maybe we could do red pot here. Yeah, we'll do red pot. Forty six percent cooldown reduction at the moment. It's kind of crazy, actually. It's because the the dust guard gives haste, plus the boots as well. That AoE damage from that tier mat is actually like really high. Like what? Alright, well Ocean Soul's up in a sec. I might just wait here. The band of final through here. Me and Yumi can take it out. What's the idea of this build? I don't know. People have been just doing it. It's just lots of Q damage. Nice. Crap, missed. I think we should just look to end. We haven't got minions for the sideways. Let's just stay here. We've got Ocean Soul. We should be able to end. It's just a shame that Olaf's not here. Okay, I've done the ulti. That makes things a lot easier. respawning as well. Well, Soul's the best. Most people would say Ocean, but I think statistically, Mountain Soul has the highest win rate. I think it's well, at least that's what it used to be anyway. forever. Yeah, 
my god. Even have to use this quick silver sash in here. <laughs> it's like dodgeball. Nah. <laughs> yeah, press it. I didn't see the damage number at the end then. What was the press the attack damage number at the end? And she surprised me a bit. Ooh, a chest. That 1.6k? Nice. I think Conqueror con would have been pretty high there though. Like I was constantly attacking, so that Conqueror would have still been really good there anyway. Oof. Nice. Wouldn't have been able to do like half that stuff though without the Yumi heals. Yumi's just broken right now. Yeah, hope you guys enjoyed that little fun game of Ezreal. The Ezreal can be useful, but you just got to have an AD carry that just knows how to play Ezreal, like Arcane shifting into Darius. It's pretty good. Yeah.